Hello everyone out there. Praise the Lord and thank you for tuning in to the God Seller 7 channel. I have another end time message I'd like to read for you today. Um, I'm going to start in the book of Revelation. So I'm going to be in Revelation 21, uh, 22 to 27. Uh, the title in uh, the Bible of this passage is The Glory of the New Jerusalem. But I saw no temple in it, for the Lord God Almighty and the Lamb are its temple. The city had no need of the sun or of the moon to shine in it, for the glory of God illuminated it. The Lamb is its light, and the nations of those who are saved shall walk in its light, and the kings of the earth bring their glory and honor into it. Its gates shall not be shut at all by day. There shall be no night there. And they shall bring the glory and the honor of the nations into it. But there shall by no means enter it anything that defiles or causes an abomination or a lie, but only those who are written in the Lamb's book of life. So this is another strong anti-message I have. And as you can see, it's talking about the Lamb's book. O oh, my servant, whom I have chosen from many, how happy I am when I see the works done in my name. For only those who do my will will enter into my door. A great place has been prepared for you. No man can imagine the wonders of the eternal kingdom and the rest in my Father's house. Eternal life and the peace of the Most High come with a great price. You must lay down your flesh and take up your spirit. But the proud and the vain and the selfish and the liars and the workers of inequity are unable to break through the sin to see the kingdom. Many called will not come, for they believe life consists of earthly things. They think pleasures of this world are greater than the next. Only the chosen will enter in. The time is short. Make haste and be ready, for my return is nigh. Be watchful and wait, pray without ceasing, as an escape has been prepared for my bride. No harm shall come to thee. Those that do not heed my word await a terrible death by fire. They shall run to and fro, but cannot hide. They will cry out for mercy, and there will be none. For when they were called, they would not come. They would not ask, so it was not given. All those whose names that are not written in the Lamb's book shall burn in everlasting fire. Damnation will be their friend, and Satan will be their shepherd. Now that's not the shepherd I want to have dealings with. I want to have the good shepherd, the shepherd that hears us, the shepherd that is calling us, and I'm asking you, again, if you're not saved, uh, to call on the Lord Jesus Christ. Uh, let him into your heart. He wants you uh, to be with him for eternity. He does not want anyone to perish these, in these horrible things that are going to come. Uh, as I stated earlier, if you've uh, read, heard any of my messages, um, I have many, many anti-messages um, and the Lord just put it on me in um, August. I started uh, taping the messages uh, for view on YouTube. And um, it was an urgency with the Lord. He put it on me to hurry up and get these messages on uh, the YouTube so that it could be presented to his people, the ones that have not come forward, uh, so that they will be able to do what's needed so they can be saved. So you do not want to be down here and as the Lord said in the prophecy, have Satan as your shepherd. I want the good shepherd and I want to be with the Lord. So I'm asking you now to repent and be baptized in the name of Jesus so that you can receive the Holy Spirit and the gifts of the Spirit. And um, again, I'm going to pray for all those unsaved out there 
that maybe something in the message will stir you and you'll feel the urgency to move forward with the Lord Jesus Christ. He is our Savior. You can't get to heaven without Him. He is the only way. Uh, and again, I want to thank you for tuning in to the God's Hiller 7 channel. And praise the Lord and have a safe day today in Jesus' name.